Hey guys, so I just parked my car back there. We are at the beginning here of the dam here on the Yakin River. The Tellwater Access. And I just decided to park on the other side of the gate just because I might cut it a little close on the time today. Just walking down here to the water. Water's moving pretty good, so I think this our little trek today will go pretty quick. We got the wife down there. She's ready to put in. She's just waiting on me. So we got 6.7 miles planned. Pretty excited. Never done this before. Hopefully, um, hopefully it's good for for the wife. I think it'll be fine. That's what we see back there, and we'll see you on the river. So with that, right. we pushed off for our first paddle of the year. That first paddle has slowly become a tradition. It's a good time to get out with the wife and try out new gear. There was a lot of new gear this year. A new boat? I'll talk about that a little more later. A new camera and camera angles and other things. Today, we were paddling from the tailwater of the W. Kerscott Dam to the Smoot Park Access in North Wilkesboro. I hope you enjoy this 6.7 mile afternoon paddle with us. Sometimes things don't work out. This camera angle so far, it's a bust. The Prion Yukon Expedition, a kayak I've been looking for for quite some time. I finally came across one this past December while on vacation in Florida. A nice young guy named Anthony didn't have a need for the boat. He mostly kayaked for fishing and he already had a boat he liked better for that. This boat can handle a lot, from slow moving rivers to class 3 and above rapids. At 14 and a half feet long, it has the desired storage capacity for multi-day trips. It also has the versatility to maneuver rocks 
and rapids as a whitewater boat would. I've heard a lot about this kayak and I am super excited to finally have one. Thanks to you, Anthony, this boat will have plenty of adventure. Yeah, keep right. Pretty cold. You got a paddle, honey. Paddle. Good job. Center um, under this bridge, center between the two pillars. Just avoid that tree that's further down after that little rapid. You see that? That's what I mean. You want to be left of that probably.
This is, I believe, the Reddy's River. What? The Reddy's River. Oh, okay. Which I do want to run sometime. It's got, I think, up to class three rapids on it. A large part of this run is alongside the Greenway in North Wilkesboro. It's just beautiful scenery on a great part of the Upper Yakin River. There's gonna be a big turn up here. After we go past the turn, I think that's not far from far past that. After paddling this section, I would say this is a great family run with maybe about three class one rapids. What I like about it is most of the rapids you can paddle around if you don't want to run them. Also, there is great current which makes the paddle easy and in under two hours. What? I don't know if I have my car key. Are you kidding me? No. I don't know if I grabbed it out of the purse or not. Let's get out and we'll figure it out. You don't have to do it. Of course, what is a river paddler's adventure without a little side adventure?
So we're here at the takeout and that's a good thing. Uh, the only problem is uh, this vehicle, we don't have the key to get in the vehicle. So, oops. Um, so just a little advice. When you are going kayaking and you leave one vehicle, uh, make sure you bring the key with you so when you get to said vehicle, you can get in the vehicle. But it's all good, we're gonna figure it out. Hey guys, so it's 8.15 and you look behind us, we finally got the car packed up and ready to go. About two hours after we took out. Um, so <laughs> we, we wanna say thank you to Chris and Lacey much much love and appreciation god send angels such great samaritans that helped us out in our predicament because there are no ubers or lifts where we are so thank much thanks to them or we probably would still be waiting on family members to come rescue our butts yeah so thank you again we really appreciate it and we look forward to meeting up with you guys again in the future yes thank you